Okay, this could affect so many people. Mm -hmm. As the tree pollen levels rise, allergy experts say now is the time to get ahead of the misery. Yeah, and new this morning, John Shumway reached out for some advice to minimize the discomfort. Help us here, John. What do we need to know? Yeah, as you will be hearing from Mary shortly, the uh, numbers on the pollen counts, especially from the trees, are going up this week. And the key is to not get to that miserable feeling at all if you can help it. While the wonder of spring can be beautiful as the trees bloom, for many, there's a very different experience. It gets you watery eyes and nose, and uh, if it's really bad, it can be pretty unbearable, so people can suffer pretty miserably. AHN allergy immunology specialist Dr. Russell Traster has seen some suffering folks. Sometimes in kids, too, we'll see in the springtime especially the tree pollen can uh, affect their eyes get really itchy and even swollen. So sometimes I see kids with their eyes are almost swollen shut due to the tree pollen. Dr. Traster says as the levels rise, keep the car and house windows closed and you might want to change your furnace filter. Uh, if you haven't done it in a while, when you open those things up they're they can be pretty dirty. So uh, they're probably not doing much of anything at that point. So it's a good idea to change them. While grass pollen is still ahead, there's plenty of tree pollen in the grass. So you might want to consider a mask. If you're really suffering outdoors, it, it can at least uh, help minimize some of those symptoms, especially when you're mowing the yard. And Dr. Traster says don't wait until you're suffering to start the antihistamines like Zyrtec or Claritin. The nose sprays really do take a little bit of time to kick in, and it's important when you're going to use them to use them every day. Yeah, and Dr. Tracer points out that we're not talking life and death here, but we are talking about the quality of life. If you're an allergy sufferer, you know what we're talking about. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. So it's the ounce of prevention theory here. Yeah, especially with those sprays, because they do take a couple of days to kick in and be effective. And with the pollen levels going up this week, and it's not just coming from the trees, that stuff ends up in the grass as well. Then you cut the grass and it's just oh, everywhere. Oh. Yeah insufferable. You know what? I was never allergic to anything until like five years ago and now tree pollen gets me. Isn't it crazy how things change and suddenly it's like, oh, I never felt that before, but right. here it is. Yep. Here it is. It's a rude awakening. All right. Thanks, John. We sure. appreciate it.